another very important organ that I forget to mention so far that could get damaged when you have high blood pressure is your liver. Now, what are some of the damages that could happen to your liver when you have high blood pressure? When you have high blood pressure, your body is under a lot of stress. The sympathetic nervous system is activated. When the sympathetic nervous system is activated, you have less blood flow towards your skin and more blood flow towards your muscles and your brain. What happens if you are stressed all the time and your blood pressure is high all the time? Then your blood will constantly get diverted more to your brain and your muscles and less towards your skin. That's where all the fat, all the fat cells are. What happens to all the food that you eat? It needs to go somewhere. If the blood is going more to the muscles and to the brain, your brains are not designed to store food. Your muscles are not designed to store food. They can only store a very small amount. But there are less blood going to your skin where all the fat cells are. So that means all the fats around the skin will be less effective at storing the food that you've eaten. So it will take much longer for the food to be stored in your fat cells as fat. So what happens then? If you have a lot of food in your bloodstream, your liver will be the hero. It will store the excess food as glycogen, as fat, in the liver. So if that happens for a long, long time, the amount of fat in the liver will increase and you start to get fatty liver. So your liver will start to get bigger and bigger over time. And if the disease progress and get worse, you might get cirrhosis of the liver. Over time, you see, you see the stomach get bigger and bigger. Uh, that's an indication of uh, fatty liver. That is some of the damage that could happen to your liver when you have high blood pressure.